space doesn't show it, but forever young Dick Clark launched musical careers on American Bandstand from the 50s straight through to the 90s. But the real stars of the show may have been the dancers. Now as Bandstand celebrates its 40th anniversary, some of those dance and teens are reminiscing about the show that made them famous. This is the number one song. Number one record. Number today. one song. The music, the fashion, the dance steps, and the stars. From Frankie Avalon and Chubby Checker in the 50s to John Travolta in the 70s, American Bandstand was the show counting down hit after top 10 hit. Number one song at the hop. From hip hopping and bobby socks to bumming and bell bottoms, for 40 years, teenagers across the country tuned in to Dick Clark's American Bandstand to spot popular trends. People always love to watch people, especially younger people, you see what they wore, what they were dancing to, how they acted toward one another, the hairstyles. This is the number one song. The beat goes on. And it was the regulars, the popular dancers who appeared repeatedly on the show, that set many of those trends. We actually never auditioned dancers. Uh, some of them were good, some of them were awful. And I think that was part of the charm. Bunny Gibson danced on American Bandstand from 1959 to 1962. To celebrate the show's 40th anniversary, she helped organize a reunion of regulars in Philadelphia, where the show was originally produced. Bunny got the chance to reminisce and jitterbug with her partner, Steve Colinero. The most amazing thing was when I would go to the magazine stands and see myself listed as America's bandstand sweetheart and up there listed in, with popularity polls with Elvis Presley. And we had playing clubs and fan mail and uh, all kind of presents and gifts and offers to us. Unbelievable. On the back of 16 Magazine, Dick Clark, me, Bobby Jaron. Wow. Looking back, it's still hard for Bunny to believe her fame, but she has no doubts about why American Bandstand enjoyed four decades of success. Kids love to watch kids dancing. I actually consider us to be like the rock and roll pioneers of dancing. American Bandstand aired every weekday afternoon until 1963 when it switched to Saturdays only. It still stands as the longest running show in ABC's history.